In life, we all face private battles and personal challenges that often remain unseen by others. There are moments when life throws us into the deep end, reminding us just how fragile and powerless we are. We witness people who seem to have it all together, only to face unexpected crises that turn their lives upside down. We see individuals who work tirelessly for their families, only to find that their absence has caused deep rifts in their relationships. These experiences teach us that we are not in control of our lives as much as we might like to believe. It's easy to think that our achievements, health, or well-being are solely the result of our own efforts. But the truth is, every breath we take, every moment of good health, is a gift from the mercy of God. It is His grace that sustains us each day, not our own strength or abilities. 1 Corinthians 10 verse 12 warns us, Therefore let anyone who thinks that he stands take it lest he fall. This scripture reminds us to stay humble and vigilant. No matter how secure or strong we might feel, we are always in need of God's guidance and protection. Our confidence should not be in ourselves, but in the Lord who strengthens us. Humility is crucial in our spiritual journey. If you find yourself in a season of ease and prosperity, praise God, but also remember to extend compassion and understanding to those who are struggling. No one is immune to life's trials. The most prayerful, devoted Christian still faces their own battles. Hebrews 4 verse 16 assures us, Let us then with confidence draw near to the throne of grace, that we may receive mercy and find grace to help in time of need. It's okay to ask God for help. He desires us to rely completely on Him, leaning on His strength rather than our own. The Bible is filled with stories of individuals who faced overwhelming challenges but found their way through with God's help. Consider Moses, who fled to the wilderness to escape Pharaoh's wrath. Despite his excuses and doubts about his ability to lead, God used his weaknesses to display his strength. Esther faced emotional turmoil and risked her life to save her people, demonstrating incredible courage through God's empowerment. David, despite fleeing from Saul and dealing with family betrayal, continued to trust in the Lord. Joseph was betrayed and sold into slavery, while Hannah faced barrenness and Job endured unimaginable suffering. Yet, each of these individuals held on to their faith, and in time, they saw the goodness and faithfulness of God. As you confront your own trials, remember that you are not alone. God is with you in every struggle, even when you cannot see his hand at work. Your battles, whether physical, emotional, or spiritual, are known to him. The Bible assures us in Psalm 34 verse 18, The Lord is near to the brokenhearted and saves the crushed in spirit. Prayer for strength and guidance. Father God, your word in Matthew 11 verse 28 invites us, Come to me, all who labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. We come before you today, Lord Jesus, seeking your help and intervention in our lives. We acknowledge our limitations and our need for your grace and strength. Lord, you know the private battles we face, the struggles that no one else sees. We come to you with our burdens, asking for your supernatural breakthrough. Move in our lives, Holy Spirit, and be our comfort in times of trouble. We thank you for your unfailing love and mercy which covers both our visible and hidden battles. We ask for your divine protection, Father. You are aware of our personal struggles and the challenges we face. We seek your intervention in every area of our lives. For those who are mourning, grant peace and comfort. For those who are weary, provide strength and renewal. For those who are weak, be their fortress and their refuge. We pray for freedom from the chains that bind us. Set us free from fear, anxiety, and unrest. Break the strongholds that hold us back and the chains that weigh us down. We declare that no weapon formed against us shall prosper, 
as promised in Isaiah 54 verse 17. We trust in the power of your name, Lord Jesus, to bring about victory and healing. As we face our challenges, help us to remain steadfast in our faith. May we not be overwhelmed by our circumstances, but find strength in your promises. We believe that you are working on our behalf, even when we cannot see the outcome. Grant us wisdom and discernment to navigate through our difficulties. Lord, we give you the throne of our hearts. We praise you for your greatness and your ability to perform miracles. We trust in your word, believing that you will bring about a breakthrough in our lives. May your name be glorified in our struggles and triumphs alike. We thank you for hearing our prayer. We submit our requests to you, confident in your power and love. It is in the name of Jesus Christ that we pray. Amen. Let's reflect. This prayer and reflection remind us that our strength and success are not our own, but come from the grace of God. No matter what battles we face, God's power is made perfect in our weakness. By humbly acknowledging our need for Him, we invite His strength to support us in our journey. As you move forward, carry this assurance with you, God sees your struggles, knows your heart, and walks with you through every trial. Lean on Him, trust in His plans, and find comfort in His unwavering presence. Remember that even in the midst of life's most challenging moments, you are not alone. God's promises are a beacon of hope and a source of unwavering strength. His grace is more than sufficient to carry you through every trial and tribulation. As we face our personal battles, let us be reminded of the truth in 2 Corinthians 12 verses 9 to 10, which assures us that God's power is perfected in our weakness. When we feel weakest, He is strongest. As you navigate through your struggles, Hold on to the promise of Psalm 46 verse 1, which declares, God is our refuge and strength, a very present help in trouble. This verse assures us that God is not a distant deity but an ever-present help, ready to offer support, comfort, and intervention in our times of need. As we conclude this time of prayer and reflection, carry with you the assurance that God's grace is indeed sufficient for you. Every obstacle you face is an opportunity for His power to be revealed in your life. Stand firm in the knowledge that no matter what you encounter, God is with you, guiding, strengthening, and providing for you every step of the way. In your moments of weakness, let His strength be your foundation. When doubts and fears arise, turn to Him with confidence, knowing that He is more than able to handle every situation. Embrace the truth that with God, all things are possible, and hold fast to his promises. If this message has touched your heart and uplifted your spirit, I encourage you to take a moment to reflect on the areas in your life where you need to rely more on God's strength. Remember that his grace is sufficient for you, and his power is made perfect in your weakness. Embrace your need for God, and let his strength carry you through every challenge. As you continue to grow in your faith and walk with God, I invite you to explore more content on this channel. There are many more prayers, 